Oh, yeah, buddy. It's that ambition being paid for the next day in the form of soreness. Um, I didn't do too much other than what you guys saw yesterday in that quick video. Maybe just another extra set after that of 10 more of the 135 deadlifts. But man, I woke up so sore this morning. It is unreal. But I think part of being accountable is just continually being present. So here I am, right? I got my I got my coffee out here with me. I got my bug light plugged in. I'm starting to acclimate to the cold. I'm ready and I'm set up to go ahead and get into hopefully, you know, day two of the rest of my life of body transformation. I don't know if it's going to go well. I don't know if the people who are used to me making gun videos are going to go ahead and uh, be cool with the, the fitness segue. But you know what? It's part of my life. And it's like I told somebody in, in the uh, comments section yesterday. YouTube is actually one of the most accurate representations of the history of my life that I physically have access to at this point. So because of that fact, I really kind of want to make it more of a genuine history for the people who will watch it, you know, hopefully, you know, in years to come. If I, was, if I was to pass away tomorrow, my daughter who doesn't know me yet would at least have something to look back on, right? So. I think I'm going to add this section, and if you guys want to watch the fitness videos, do so. If you don't, you know, please feel free to pass, and if you feel that strongly about it, unsubscribe, you know, here you go. Cheers to you guys. Cheers to the unsubscribers. Oh, there goes that bug light, dude. That thing is lit. Let me show you guys my bug light real quick. Yo, best thing ever. Northern California gets haggard mosquitoes around this time of year. So this is literally the only reason why I can be out in the pergola in these pre-dawn hours. Otherwise, I would be absolutely eaten alive. I feel like today would be a really good day to do something completely not back oriented based on the fact that I do have that residual soreness, but I didn't want to use it as a cop out excuse to try and just get out of working out today. If you guys are a fan of the channel and subscribed, you would know that I do have kind of that ex-con, ex-prison, ex-incarceration style background, and I do have that 100 push-up set that I do like to do pretty much before I do any type of workout, and I'm going to get back to doing that. So basically 100 push-ups in a row, and just like a you know big boy of the strength cartel did in his video series about this you don't have to go all the way through the entire motion it's just getting that blood pumping getting that blood flowing getting things ready to rock and roll for whatever it is that you do next and going through that 100 reps motion of, of just body weight even like I said if you don't go through the entire repetition of all the way down all the way up on the push-up you can net some pretty good results at least as far as like blood flow initial pump and uh, getting ready for the rest of your workout after that I think we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna focus on one of my favorite things to focus on because I'm a creature of vanity and uh, it's gonna be arm day right this is probably a different type of video than you guys are used to but this is literally the things that matter to me when I go to the gym right do I do I look like I have a good back when I go ahead and stand up straight I deadlift do I look like I got good arms when I go ahead and you know cut the sleeves off that's why I do arm day so today is gonna be uh, today is gonna be biceps and, and honestly I like to do one muscle group a day at least in the inception so that I can not only start slow but I could also go ahead and hopefully eliminate rest days right I don't I don't really like to have rest days I would rather work one individual muscle group every day that won't you know hopefully have a negative or adverse effect on whatever it is I work the next day and then just stay consistently working out once I do start to do these types of things definitely don't want to go ahead and make this too much of a talking video for you guys though I'm gonna go ahead and get right into it with that 100 push-up set Come and support me, homie. 84. Really struggling. But it's important to me to get it's important to me to get that whole set. Really fighting at the end. Four more. almost 40 years old, it's a humbling experience. When I was uh, 
incarcerate a good. No problem. Now here I am. No edits. Struggling to get through this set. But hopefully we'll improve with time. I think anything you do long enough you're gonna get good at. This is no exception. Having been accountable too and having like completed that, that makes you feel good. That was not easy. That was not easy. It was also not easy to go ahead and fail publicly. I know that footage is going to be cringy for me to watch as far as getting through the push-ups and such, but I felt like, you know, out of out of integrity, it needed to be shown, right? Nobody just goes out and blasts out 100 push-ups in a row after not doing it for months at a time. So I think that my journey, at least, was documented to be a genuine one. <sighs> Sitting back in the pergola once again. Got my Premier Protein here. It's just whatever I was able to steal from the wife. I didn't know that I was gonna be going on this fitness journey last week, so I'm not like prepared nutritionally. I ate like shit yesterday. And uh, yeah, I was able, I think she uses this in her coffee. So this is the direct, this, I think she uses this in her coffee. So this is our protein source post-workout for the day. Cheers, boys. I don't know how this is going to go. And I'm not trying to teach anybody anything through these videos whatsoever, except that maybe you might be able to get some decent results at something if you stick with it and put your mind to it and give it the best effort that you possibly can. Um, hopefully these videos just document me trying to stave off that which my fourth decade on this planet is trying to do to me as far as aging is concerned and uh, maybe you guys will get a kick out of seeing somebody who usually does a different type of video off the beaten path for myself creatively did want to give you guys a quick pulse workout pump this arm day one of the best days that you can have in the gym this is day two arm day post workout pump hell yeah hopefully we'll improve this over time if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more content like this, make sure you subscribe for more with that notifications button so that you can stay current on these channel as well as when these workouts come out. If you really like this video, make sure you share it so that somebody else can see it and I'll catch you boys in the next one.